Hello, people. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Well, it is time to get started. What we did last night at the end of the class. Okay, last class we finished talking about this conversation. Remember, we read this conversation, but we didn't have time to practice it. So we are going to practice. Maybe we just practice it once. Okay, let me read the conversation one more time. How did you get into modeling, Stacy? Well, when I graduated from drama school, I moved to Los Angeles to look for work as an actor. I was going to auditions every day but I never got any parts and I was running out of money. So what did you do? I got a job as a waitress in a seafood restaurant. While I was working there, a customer offered me some work as a model. Within a few weeks, I was modeling full time. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay. Now let's do this. I will be Richard and you will be Stace. Okay? So I am Richard, you are Stace. Please repeat. No, 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 no. Don't repeat. Just I am Richard and you are Stacy. Okay. How did you get into modeling, Stacy? Well, well, when I graduated from jump school, I moved to Los Angeles for work as an actress. I was going to audition for everything, but I never had any part. And I was running out of money. I was running out of money. Money. Oh, what did you do? I, I got, got a job in a restaurant. While I was working there, a customer asked me to model. Within a few weeks, I was modeling full time. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay, now let's switch. You are Richard and I am Stacy. So you begin at one, two, three. How, How did you get into the modeling, Stacy? Well, when I graduated from drama school, I moved to Los Angeles to look for work as an actress. I was going to auditions every day, but I never got any parts and I was running out of money. So, oh, what, what, what did you do? I got a job as a waitress in a seafood restaurant. While I was working there, a customer offered me some work as a model. 
within a few weeks, I was modeling full. What a lucky break. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay, very good. Now, um, so I showed you, I, I want to ask you, so this sentences or, or questions in yellow uh, are sentences in what tense, what tense are these sentences? Past, simple past. Yes. All of these sentences in yellow are simple past sentences. If you observe simple past sentences, describe actions that began and finished in the past. Okay, so the action began in the past and finished in the past. So I'm describing an, a completed action, an action already finished. Yeah, I graduated from drama school, so I'm describing that uh, uh, that action is over, it's finished. I moved to Los Angeles. Okay. What about the sentences in green? What tense are they? Past continuous. Right. This is what we call past continuous or past progressive, you might hear that also. Past progressive or past continuous. So in past continuous sentences, we're talking about continuous action that happened in the past. So I'm describing an activity that I did for a period of time. I was going to auditions every day. So it's an action that I kept doing for a period of time. I was running out of money. I was working there. So I began here and I continued working for a period of time. I was modeling full time. Okay. So let me show you that here in the grammar section, the grammar focus. Past continues versus simple past. Let's compare past continuous versus simple past. Let me see here. Okay. Past continuous are for an action in progress in the past, you see? I was going to auditions every day. I was running out of money. I was working at the restaurant. What is the structure of this kind of sentence? If we focus here. Okay, what is the structure here? Basically, What, what is this? What is this? What? Uh -huh. So, we're going to use was or where, okay, depending on the subject. Basically here, we're studying only sentences using was, but you can use where, because depending on the subject, remember that we use this here, we use was with I, he, he, and it. We use where with you, we and they. and they. Okay. Good. What is next? 
after the verb be in the past. What is the verb be in the past? The main verb plus ing. Well, okay. in ing form. Okay. The verb in ing form, which is called the present participle. Okay. Or the present parties or gerunds. Depending on the. Yeah, gerunds. Could be gerund or could be present part. Okay. Okay. Or basically the ing form. I was going, I was running, I was working. You were going, you were running, you were working. Okay, he was going, he was running. They were working. Okay. And simple past, we said it's only for a completed action. I never got any parts. When I got a job as a waitress, a customer offered me a job as a mom. So for simple past, we only use the main verb. In past. In past. Okay, for affirmative sense. All right. Well, let's see. Let's complete these eight sentences. Um, whether in simple past or in past continuous. Okay. Okay. For example, let's let me show you the first one. So the first one should be I was. Driving, driving in England when I suddenly realized. realized I was on the wrong side of the road. Okay? Very good. Usually we use past continuous with simple past when we talk about an action that was in some way interrupted by another action. I was going to mm -hmm. auditions every day, but I never got any points. Or when you want, we want to describe two actions that happened in the past, we can use continuous and simple past. So okay. I will give you time to work individually on these sentences. After a few minutes, I will send you to work in groups, check your work to compare your work okay and then we'll come back to check your set okay okay very good just let me okay work individually i'm going to send the exercise to whatsapp to help you with There you
When you finish, please raise your virtual hand. Let me know that you are done, okay? Hey, Yancy, come on. Okay, I see six hands up. Okay, two, four, five, nine, hands up. Okay. 
Okay, I will send you to working groups to compare your your work. Okay. Join the breakout rooms, please, for a moment. Compare your work. And we'll be back in a few minutes.
Okay, welcome back. Okay. Let's see, number. Number two. Uh, Alexander, can you read me sentence number two, please? Uh, Jamie Rosibel. Mande. Number two, please. The two is I was living mm -hmm. with my grandparents when I entered uh, high school. Okay. Entered high school. Okay. Thank you. Let's see. Jansi Sarai, number three. I don't know, teacher. It was making. Making. Okay, no problem. Natalie, number three. Okay, I was making dinner last night when the phone rang. Okay. Dinner last night when the phone rang. You. Now, uh, Julissa, number four. Tracy and Eric were working in a restaurant in Vancouver when they met. Okay. Thank you. Jamie Lopez, number five. Okay. Several years ago, I were having problems with math, so I had to find a tutor. I was well, having problems, problems with math, so I had, had to find. Okay. Floor number six, please. Okay. We were living in a tiny apartment when our first child was born. Okay. Elizabeth, number seven. there. Alejandra, number seven. Um, my brother was, uh, I'm not sure, ice skating. Yes, that's right. Ice skating. Oh. When he, when he was, Broke his arm. Uh, when he broke, simple pass, his arm. That's it. Okay. okay. And finally, Luis, number eight. I was watching TV when the power went out. Very good. Okay. 
Let's read these sentences. Let me read them and record the audio for you. We'll be able to later if you want. One, I was driving in England when I suddenly realized I was on the wrong side of the road. Two, I was living with my grandparents when I entered high school. Three, I was making dinner last night when the phone rang. Four, Tracy and Eric were working in a restaurant in Vancouver when they met. Five, Several years ago, I was having problems with math, so I had to find a tutor. Six, we were living in a tiny apartment when our first child was born. Seven, my brother was ice skating when he broke his arm. Eight, I was watching TV when the power went out. Very good. Any question, people, with this exercise? No question. Okay. No. Okay. So the next part says complete these sentences with interesting information about yourself. Use the simple past or the past continuous. Let me show you how I did it. It is about me, okay? During my childhood, I lived in San Salvador. I met my best friend when, while I was working in Santa Tecla. When I was going to elementary school, I didn't have to take a bath. Two years ago, I was working in San Salvador. Last year, I went to Bogota, Colombia. That's me, okay? Now I want you to write sentences about you, All right? I will give you a few minutes to do it. Again, when you finish, please raise your virtual hand to let me know that you did it. Let's finish. Oh, I'm sorry, Elizabeth. Let me. And the That's the record. It will be a long silence. There you are. Thank you. 
Okay, people, I will send you to working groups to talk about your sentences, okay? Please join the breakout rooms. Hey, me too. <laughs> <laughs> well, I still love him to dance. <laughs> ah, yes, me too. But my friends doesn't doesn't dance, so I could then couldn't dance with nobody. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> oh yes. Okay, number four. In number four, I have two years ago I was working at home. Okay. I had two years ago, my father bought a Labrador. Hello, people. Hello, teacher. She'll be talking. Sorry, I'm not talking because I am still working. Oh. Vanessa? Hello, Vanessa. She's not responding. Okay, so I will send you to another group, Elizabeth, to practice, okay? Well, Lupe is working and Vanessa is not responding. Okay, Elizabeth, move to another group, please, to practice. Hello, people. Hello. Hello. 
should be talking. Yes, we were practice <laughs> our sentence. We are talking about the question, but we are only two people here. We're waiting for the other. Mm. But I think so he's not there. Okay. It's okay. We want to practice. Again, during my childhood, I live in the in La Paz. Okay. My Well, teacher, we already finished. Okay. Okay, welcome back. So quickly, tell me something about you, okay? Whatever you want, using those sentences. Let me start with Julissa. Tell me something about you, Julissa. Okay. Um, when I was going to elementary school, I learned to play basketball. Ah, okay, very good. Marina, tell us about you. Last year, I celebrate my brother's graduation. Okay. Ana Lilian? I'm responding. Luis? Oh, yes. Ana Lilian? Hi, teacher. I'm sorry, I, I can hear, hear him. Okay. So tell us something about you. About me. Um, Using those sentences from the exercise. Okay. When I... Wait a moment, wait a moment. Um, when I have a ch child, I, ha I live in San Salvador. Um, I was working in different companies uh, like... Um, financial banks and in other companies. Mm -hmm. um, I, wa I was um, studied at um, Francisco Gavidia University. Okay. In, uh, okay, remember that when we talk about Completed actions, like I studied at Francisco okay. Gaviria University, we use the simple past. Oh. Okay. Okay, I studied at this place, okay. Okay. for example. Very good. Thank you, Ana Lili. I can, I can wait at the class. Oh, okay. Okay, I got it. Okay, Luis. Flor? Ernesto? Hi. Okay, Hi. Flor? I'm here. Yes. 
well, one sentence about you. Um, well, when I was going to elementary school, I was in the soccer team. Okay. It's Thank okay. you. Yeah, that's that's okay. okay. Ernesto. Um, during my childhood, I like play football. Okay, I like, I like, like playing. Like yeah, I like playing football. Okay, Vanessa. Not there. Uh, okay, Elizabeth, and that will the will be the last one because it's nine or two. Okay, Elizabeth. I have I have a five I have five licenses. I live in Sonsonate. I was working in in a watch farm. I didn't have to drive my car and work. I was working on the border of the La Chadura. I went to the Guatemala. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, people, we're going to stop here tonight. We'll continue tomorrow. Um, maybe it's a different thing. Okay, so that's all for today. Have a good night. Take care and see you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow, people. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow, teacher. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. -bye. Bye. See you tomorrow.